Kim. Today is November 22nd, 2009, and I'm here at Belcher Ogden, and I'm speaking with Mr. Harris. How are you, Mr. Harris? Fine, thank you. And you? I'm good. Um, okay, so it, first, is it okay if we put this interview on YouTube? Oh, yes. Yes, it's okay with me. Okay. Um, so what brings you here today, Mr. Harris? Well, Ms. McBean has been working with me for quite some time, and she invited me over here for this uh, brunch, and I wanted to see and I wanted to meet some of the, uh, the other people from other organizations here. Okay. Um, so how are you affiliated with Future City? Well, locally, I'm the, uh, the president of the Block Watch in this area, so that keeps me busy. Plus, I'm committee man for District 6, so that's this area. So they keep me pretty busy in the neighborhood. Okay. Um, so how long have you known us? Oh, gee, about five, six years, yes. Quite some time. Mm -hmm. Okay. So what are your expectations for FCI for the rest of the year? Um, is there anything you're looking forward to? Well, I'm interested in the youth of this area because that's, they're our future, and I'm trying to get them organized. Uh, we're having the, uh, a Christmas tree lighting December 12th with Santa Claus, trying to get the young people back into the area. And that's my expectation because, like I said, the youth is our future and I'm trying to keep them straight and keep them positive. Okay, um, so do you have any suggestions for next year's brunch? No, everything is working good. The invitations have got a good turnout for it. It's very good. She's doing very good. But Miss McBean has been my idol, so. <laughs> <laughs> so I depend on everything. I depend on her and I meet her all the time and I go for suggestions and we've been working very good together. That's good to hear. Well, I uh, thank you for your time, Mr. Harris, okay. and you enjoyed the rest of your time. Okay, thank okay. you very much. You're welcome. Thank you.